Welcome to our Halloween edition of Tiger Tales. I'm Libby Quick, your host, here along with my special friend. I'm Emmy. I really love your costume, Emmy. Thank you. I worked really hard on my cat costume this morning. I almost forgot it. That would have been awful. That would have been so bad, but I'm super glad you grabbed it. Me too, but hey, I have a bunch of Halloween jokes up my sleeve. Well, hey, Emmy, let's hear it. Which ghost is the best dancer? I don't know. Hit me with it. The Boogeyman! <laughs> that was a good one. Thank you. I have one more before you read the poems. You want to hear it? Yeah, I do. What do you call a skeleton that sits around all day? I think I know this one. Do you call them lazy bones? <laughs> yeah, you're right, Liv. I thought so. Okay, so why don't we get our poems for them? Great idea. What's that running down the hall? As shadows creep up on the wall, tall and skinny, big and small, I shut my eyes to avoid the sight. What's that sound coming through my door? I grab my blanket and hit the floor. Screaming too loud for me to ignore, I brace myself for a dreadful fright. What's that smell so strong and stale? I take a deep breath and prepare to yell. Coldness comes and I turn pale. How do I escape this terrible night? What's that vision in the mirror I see? A haunting face surged back at me. I look again, how can this be? I begin to run with all my might. This form, this sound, this smell, this terror, it is me that stares back from the mirror. I scream, I shout at what I saw. I was the monster after all. Halloween Night by Emma Young. The wind blowing in the night, the moon's glowing, a faint light. Stars twinkle up high, far above in the sky. The trees sway, street lights flicker, in the roadway, costumes glitter. Baskets fill, the nights chill. Children go door to door on the patio, candy galore. Tricking treats, candy so sweet. Scary scarecrows, spooky ghosts, do they know they're fooling most? The fun night, Halloween, full of treats and screams. Those were spooktacular. All right, Emmy, that's enough jokes for now. But I do agree, those poems were pretty great. I think the high school students did an amazing job writing them. I agree. I wonder if any of them are going trick-or-treating. Are you? Of course I am. I couldn't miss out on all the free candy. That's right. Don't forget about all the candy you're going to get. Are you going with someone? Yeah, I'm going with my friends and family, so I'm not alone. That's a good point. We want you guys to remember to not go walking around in your neighborhood or anywhere else alone. It could be dangerous. Make sure you have an adult with you at all times because we want you to be safe and get as much candy as you can. Well, guys, that's all we have for this week. We hope you have a fun and safe Halloween. Bye!